hello friends once again welcome back to my channel infinity so guys uh, today i'm going to tell you that uh, how you can backup all your data when you are formatting your device or uh, when you are changing your rom so all our data has been gone so uh, you can use uh, swift backup application to backup uh, all your data and uh, save your uh, uh, internet data so how to use that just need to firstly download application named Swift Backup. So you will be telling that uh, we can also use Titanium Backup, but uh, Titanium Backup only works on Android 10 and below, and uh, it has uh, bugs and uh, uh, in many devices it doesn't support also. So you can use Swift Backup. Uh, you can easily download it from Play Store, and uh, after that uh, you have to just open it. So if you are a rooted user, you can give root access. So what's the difference here is that uh, if you are unrooted also, you can also backup your applications. But uh, if you are rooted, uh, you can also backup, uh, you can backup uh, data also with the app. Uh, uh, if your data has been backupped, then you will not, uh, you doesn't have to sign in and uh, do all that stuff. <laughs> if you are a rooted user because this backup all of your app data also and uh, after that you get uh, all your application in the state you backup and uh, you just have to restore and the application has been fully set up by default so as you can see i have granted it root access so after rooting you have to you can select storage from here like uh, it's internal for now so you can also use SD card. So like I'm going to back up my data on SD card. So you have to reset once and do nothing. So this will restart your application once. So for rooted user, this is a very useful because you can um, back up your data also. Like let me show you. Like as you can see, I'm going to back up my YT studio here so I have to just click on the icon here just click on backup and uh, now select the application which you need to backup I have selected YT studio so now just click on this and select the partitions you want to backup so for rooted user the data and the expansion etc are uh, unlocked but for non-rooted user you can only backup the application not the data so you will get the difference when i will restore this so i have successfully backed this now you have to click on done now i will exit this once so now let me show you once So as I click on YT Studio, so as you can see here, it's uh, fully set up for now. So now I'm going to delete this. So uh, now I have successfully uninstalled uh, my YT Studio app. So now I have just to click on the Swift Backup. Here I have to click on applications badge actions restore and uh, you can see what studio is in black color so it has been uninstalled by me because of which it has been faded so you have to just uh, click on the application which you want to backup and uh, this edit icon now you have to select the partitions you need to restore so i need to restore application and its data also So now it will automatically restore. No, this will not cost you any data charges. So I will prefer you using this because it works on Android 12 also. And the titanium backup is limited to Android 10 and below only. So 
as you can see our application has been successfully restored now you have to click on done so now as will as i will open my youtube studio you can see here i doesn't uh, have to sign in again and again the application is uh, in the state uh, where i left it and uh, the data is uh, safe so you can use this backup if you are a rooted user then it's uh, very useful for you and uh, if you are non rooted also then also you can use it to backup your applications and you can also backup uh, your application and data on a cloud storage like google drive etc and access is access it anywhere you want to so that's all for today thanks uh, thank you for watching have a nice day